Hello everyone, it's your boy C-Dust back again, and today I wanted to do sort of like an update video on like what's been going on on the channel. So there's just like been a lot of things on my own mind, and then there's also things that I've been working on in the background. So there's just a lot going on, I wanted to do it in like a sort of update video, explaining exactly what's going on in the channel, especially during this time with you know, the coronavirus, which now I can say because YouTube won't demonetize me, it seems. Um, but yeah, I wanted to basically go over all of that sort of stuff, but just so you guys can get a really general image of what the future holds for the channel and just updates on content coming around to you. Okay, so first things first, I guess I want to address the stuff that's just been like on my mind recently. And it's kind of something that kind of makes me a little bit mad because of the fact that it's something constantly happening. So a lot of you came to this channel for the SML drama, um, which yes, that is something that I was doing quite a bit, like probably a couple months ago. I haven't posted like a single video related to SML in like legit probably like a month or so. And I really appreciate like the immense support that all of that got me, especially to the point where we're at now, it's almost 66,000 subscribers, which is absolutely insane. And I guys, I can't thank you guys enough for the support. Every single one of you, I thank you guys so much. But there's just been some things that have been happening with uh, a lot of the people who are from that fan base. So I want to kind of address things. So. In terms of like the SML drama, uh, it's fine if you comment on my videos like explaining exactly that there's an update or something, but please don't do it on a video that's not related to the SML drama. Again, I'm not sending hate towards the people that do request it. I kind of want to keep the SML stuff away from the content that's not SML related. Uh, just keep the conversation on those videos. Or you can obviously message me on Twitter or Instagram about the SML stuff. Another thing I have received, like comments I've received is like, Oh, this is this content's so boring. Where's my SML drama? Etc. Or the other comment I've been getting is, Make an SML drama video when there's no drama out at that moment. It's like, I can't produce the drama myself. It's literally just stuff that sort of happens. Once again, like I said, I appreciate everyone, every single subscriber. If you like the SML drama stuff and you like my other content, then go ahead and subscribe. But if you're only here for that piece of content, it's probably not the best that you should be subscribed to this channel. Okay, moving on to the updates on another big thing that everyone uh, is waiting for, which is the whole Logan interview. So that's one thing that I promised you guys was a interview with Logan. Uh, now I talked about it briefly in the Q and A video, exactly what's going on with that. Obviously, a lot of you know that the coronavirus is a big thing and it's up and about, and a lot of people are trying to stay indoors because they want to stay protected. And of course, I am one of those people that has to stay inside because uh, I want to stay safe, I want to be healthy, I don't want to get sick just doing uh, a, a couple of YouTube videos or anything like that. So that's why I haven't done it. And for the people out there that think, oh, well, you, you're young, you won't get sick, uh, it's totally okay to go out. No, it's not. <laughs> Sorry to burst those people's bubbles that think that the coronavirus isn't a big deal. It is a big deal, especially for someone like me, because of the fact that the coronavirus can literally be fatal to very young people. In fact, there was a young girl, I believe she was around the age of 12 or 13, and she died. She had, like, no um, health problems whatsoever in the past, and she literally died, which is a really big deal. And... People need to realize that this can be fatal to some people. People who have the coronavirus, who have other underlying health problems, they could be higher at risk. And I am one of those people because me, myself, I have asthma. So if I were to catch the virus, it could be more fatal 
to me than it would be to maybe one of my friends who doesn't have asthma at all. So I'm just trying to stay at home for the time being until this all clears up. Now, when it actually comes to the trip itself, I do still plan on actually going down to Pensacola to meet Logan and possibly even Chile. Uh, but obviously, I don't know when exactly that will be, and I have no clue how long it's going to take because of the fact that this stuff hasn't been calming down uh, in my state. It's been sort of on the decline, but at the same time, there's like been spikes every now and again, and it's just been a really big uh, pandemic here, and it's just something that we have no control over. At least we kind of have control over. If we stay inside, we'll be uh, safer, but it's like something that we have no idea how things are going to go, because there's still people out there who won't stay inside and just kind of stay put or won't be doing social distancing like they're supposed to and obviously it ruins it for the rest of us and uh, Florida is another one because obviously I need to take into consideration my own state how they're doing with the virus and of course uh, how Florida is doing with the virus obviously because that's where I'd be going and Florida has not been doing too good especially in Escambia County which is Pensacola's uh, county and they have not been doing good whatsoever in fact they are kind of spiking up again as of recently. They might have bumped down uh, maybe today, but still, they're still pretty high up there in terms of not only uh, sicknesses, but also deaths in general, which is absolutely insane. But yeah, like I was saying though, going back on the topic of the whole trip, I don't know when this trip will take place. I'm hoping that things will clear up by the end of May or maybe early May, but looking at things so far, the beginning of May uh, to the end of May, it doesn't look like things are going to be getting much better. Obviously, the only thing we can do is just wait and see and hope that things clear up, but we just don't know, so it's just something that we have to just wait. Now, in terms of like other content on this channel, what am I doing from here on now? What's going on with like uploads? One of the things I find myself doing during this time is wanting to produce content that I think you guys would really enjoy, but I can't do it because of this whole virus thing. Recently, I've just been trying to find ways to do the content that I want to make, but do it indoors. Uh, like I said, I kind of had the one video where I tested people's knowledge on the actual coronavirus, and I basically tested them on it, and for every question they got right, they got like 10 bucks and they could win up to like a hundred dollars and of course I matched that value and I donated it to a COVID-19 relief fund which I thought that was like a cool idea and I was able to do that originally I was gonna have like people at my house but obviously social distancing so I did it like that uh, another one was like I had interviews set up with like a couple different people for uh, YouTube videos and once again I can't really meet up with those people because of the fact that this virus is going on which is really unfortunate there's just so many ideas that I've been having throughout like the virus it's like I can't do them just because it's here <laughs> and it's just it's frustrating but I'm doing my best to try and cope with it and of course that's why you've kind of been seeing a lot more of like the the, the downfall videos the one video that I was kind of like having fun making obviously were the downfall videos and then you also saw me introduce kind of like new videos with the rise videos and the evolution video uh, those ones I also had like a lot a lot of fun making I actually found myself enjoying making the evolution videos and uh, the rise video a little bit more than the downfall ones at times and that's something that I think I'm going to be continuing doing on this channel from here until the eventual lifting of this uh, stay-at-home order that we have here. Once the stay-at-home order is like lifted, I'm totally going to be doing some new content here, definitely with more human interactions. Uh, the plan is for me to do more social videos rather than videos where it's just me by myself just hanging out. I feel like I have more fun producing videos where I'm being more social and it's honestly a little bit healthier for me 
for my own health. I think a lot of you enjoy that sort of stuff a little bit more. A lot of you like the Truth About Catfish video. That one was um, one a lot of you guys liked. And I want to continue to do more of that on this channel. So definitely look forward to like the content that comes out after all of this is over. But yeah, that basically sums up uh, this update video. I just wanted to kind of get my own thoughts out there, give you guys some updates on things, and just basically give you the lowdown exactly on the future of this channel. Uh, so I hope you guys did indeed enjoy this video. Uh, let me know exactly how are you guys holding up in this whole pandemic. I hope everyone is staying safe, staying at home. Uh, obviously, get outside and be active every now and again, but of course, practice social distancing. If you're going to go outside and you see someone, then try and stay six feet away from them as you're walking by them, or if you're running by them or biking by them, etc. Just try and keep your distance a little bit in order to really protect not only yourself, but then obviously the people around you. But with that being said, I've been C Dust. I hope you guys didn't like this video. If you did, make sure to leave it a thumbs up. I've been C Dust. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.